हे माई नेम इज हैप्पी आई हेल्प कैंडिडेट्स इन डॉट नेट इंटरव्यू प्रिपरेशन आफ्टर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो यू विल बी एबल टू आंसर दिस क्वेश्चन इन एनी इंटरव्यू इफ यू हैव एनी कन्फ्यूजन इन एनी इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन देन पोस्ट इन द कमेंट सेक्शन एंड आई विल मेक एन वीडियो ऑन इट सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद दिस क्वेश्चन लेट्स सी द डिफरेंस फर्स्ट थ्रो एक्स विल चेंज द स्टैक ट्रेस वेयर एज थ्रो विल प्रिजर्व द होल स्टैक ट्रेस नाउ लेट्स ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड विद द हेल्प ऑफ द कोड see here in the code we have used throw now what we are doing here inside the method we are calling a method divide 0 by 0 now inside this method divide 0 by 0 we are trying to divide 0 by 0 at this line and this line number is 24 now when we are using throw what will it will do is it will throw the error to the upper level and then the error will be received here inside this catch block now here this ex dot stack trace will print the error which is throw by this keyword so what will be the error we will see so we will see this error in the uh, output because we are printing the output with the help of this console right line okay and we are printing the exception dot stack trace and the stack trace will be okay we are getting the error at 24 which is very much correct because we are getting the error at this position only and this line 13 so 13 is basically divide by 0 so that also will be logged by the exception so now this is about the throw keyword now what will happen in case of throw x so this is the same code just we have replaced this throw with the throw x right now we will see that what will be the output in this case what sorry uh what will this x e x dot stack trace will print so it will print this message now if you see it is showing that the error has occurred at the line number 27 see the actual position of the error is 24 but this throw x is saying that it is happening at this position which is not correct and as per the definition also throw x will change the stack trace because it has changed the stack trace it is not the actual stack trace so that is incorrect so that's why it is a best practice to use throw only as it preserve the whole stack trace so now let me show you the same thing in the code also see here is the code and the same method is here inside the main main method we have divide by 0 and then here at the line 24 there is a problem and the error line it is so now we will execute with throw keyword first so the result will be like see it is saying that the line error is at the line 24 which is the actual and correct stack trace and now we will check with throw x so now i have converted throw to throw x and even dot net compiler will say that rethrowing count exception changes stack information so it it is also giving you a warning so let's execute this and let's see what it will say so at this time the output says that the problem is at line number 27 which is this line but this is not the correct so rather always use throw do not use throw x so this is the answer of this question if you have any query about this question then please let me know in the comment section and i will try to answer it as soon as possible